dancers. So this is going to be a video of the new division four bar for this month. Um, any dancer is welcome to try and do this video, but it is specifically division four's bar. Um, I'm so excited to, to kind of dance with you and share this video. We've missed you a lot in the studio, me and Miss Amy have. Um, Miss Amy wishes she could be here to do this video with me, but she's quarantined at her house in Salt Lake. Um, but we talked on the phone and set this bar um, for you guys together. Um, and she wanted to, to remind you guys to make sure that you're using your focus very nicely and also that you're doing um, your hands, your reaching fingers in the correct position and also to make sure that you're jumping. Um, we're not gonna do any jumps, we're just setting your bar, but maybe at the end of bar, if you want, you can remember to just try to like do some jumps as high as you can, just getting in the air, or maybe some so tease in first, um, and also to make sure you're stretching at home. Okay, um, Maya's gonna help me today. Um, we're gonna do, I'm gonna teach you the combination, and then she's gonna do one side with the music. So you can follow along to learn, and then do it with her with the music. Um, so first for our plies, we have two ground plies in each position for four counts, and we're gonna keep our arm in second position. So we have arm in second, ground plie one, two, up three, and four. We'll do the same thing first, second, fourth, and fifth. Two ground plies in every position. After she does her two ground plies in fourth position, then we're gonna go court de bras forward. One, two, three, four, and up and back, keeping shoulders square, combre. Five, six, seven, coming up eight, and then we have our finish. We're opening arm to second. One, two, three, four. Then we have all of J, making sure we're doing what we've been practicing in class, reaching shoulders down, five, six, soft elbow and wrist trails, and then finish, yes? So two ground plies, four counts each, in every position, keeping arm in second. Then we have a port de bras forward, a port de bras back, and then opening our arm to all of J to finish. Here we go. I'm going to leave the album, what the album's called that I use, 
And next to every song, it says what the exercise is. So it'll say plies for the song title. So um, if you if you have Apple Music or your mom or something or Spotify, you can look up the album and do it that way. Or you can scroll back in the video to play the songs every time. Okay. So next for our tendus, we're going to have our arm in second the whole time. Um, and we have tendu for two counts and plie. One closing, two. One tendu on quad side, three closing, four. Back, five closing, six. Side, seven closing, eight. Now on the out, she's going to go to straight legs. We're going to straighten our legs. Now we have one count each and one straight legs, staying straight. So let's try that again. So we just did our last one in plie. We just closed our fifth. Sorry, that was me to the side. We did our last one in plie, we closed our fifth. And then as we go out, we go straight legs. And one, and two to the side. Side, close front. Side, close back. Two to the back. And six, side, close back. Side, close front. And finish. Oh, sorry, not finish. Repeat the exact same thing with jetes. The whole combination, just repeat with jetes. So we just have out and plie. One closing two, three closing four. This is our jeté. Five closing six, side seven, stay in plie, out stretch. And one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. Then we finish. Okay. Um, I want you to make sure as we do this exercise that we're really feeling toes back as we close to the front. As we go to the side, we're feeling our heel forward and we're beveling like we talked about in class. And then to the back, making sure our legs turned out but our hips aren't opening up. So we have to turn out but also keep our hips square. Okay, here we go with the music. Tandus and plie are two counts, out for a count, in for a count. The straight legs are one count each, out on the and and in on the count. Arm in second the whole time. Tendus and then repeat with jetes. Here we go. So, same exact thing, except we're going to go tendus, whole thing, reverse the tendus, jetés, whole thing, reverse the jeté.
front to the side, we should close on, um, on the two chandras with straight legs, we should close front first, front to back. And then we go back, but because we want to reverse it, after th this one, you actually just alternate and you go front to back. So then you can reverse your tongue. So you'll do the same thing in the reverse. Yeah? Okay, and the same thing in jatis. Okay, next we're going to do our ronda jumps. Okay, so for our ronda jumps, we're going our regular pre preparation. So we go five. Six, plie, seven, open, eight. We're going to do eight round of jumps. One, on day or two, three, four, big reaching. Five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to close to first and we're going to pour it abroad forward. One, two, three, four, and up and back. Five, six, seven, Eight, open our arm to second to reverse. Eight round jumps on day dom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Finish the eighth and close to first. Then we reverse our third quarter bra. Back, one, two, three, four, and forward. Five, six, seven, eight to finish. Okay, here we go. So that's eight round jumps on one beat, close to first, four counts forward, four counts back, and reverse. Eight round jumps on one beat, on one beat, forward, round back, and forward to finish. Here we go. to do fondues, just one fondue on releve at 45 degrees on bar. So we're going to go seven lifting, eight for our prep, plie one, up two, plie three, side four, plie five, extend six, plie seven, extend eight. Now reverse, one, up two, releve, plie up. Two releve, plie up to releve, and plie up to releve. So when Maya does it with the music, she's going to make sure she holds her arm in second the whole time. Because she's not going to do her fourth bra, just keep your arm in second. So make sure you do that too. Um, and then for our prop A, so we just did our reverse. We're going to um, stay up on our releve, and we're going to go side. Just one, out, two out three, out four, double five, hold six, double seven, hold eight, and repeat. Out one, out two, out three, out four, double five, hold six, double seven, and 
and finish. Yes, so we have one fondue at 45 degrees, plie one out on two, keeping arm in second, on releve, on qua, and reverse. And then we will do our frappes to the side. We have four singles and two double folds. And then you'll repeat, making sure in those beats, in the, in the frappes, on the doubles, that you're using wrapped as your front. Here we go.
So we'll have just going and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six. Yes? So it'll be for four sets of eight. Yeah? Four sets of eight. Um, you'll start, we'll go seven lift on eight, and you'll start front. So wrapped, wrapped back, wrapped back, wrapped back. And remember to think of like the hinge of your leg, like your, your elbow. So this part of your leg is staying still. The lower half is all that's moving and it's going open and open and not forward and back. So just that lower half of our leg is moving, not going this way as we petite bottom. Here we go. Four sets of eight on elevate, arm in center. Four sets of
to keep those knees straight to lower your legs. Um, in that exercise, I want you really to think of in all of those demi rond jambes that you're feeling your heel forward so turned out. From the back to the side, you're thinking of your heel coming, coming forward so that it stays turned out and that you don't do this with your hips. We want to keep those hips from doing lots of crazy things. And that's by lifting tall and using our turnout evenly. So both legs have to be using our turnout muscles equally. One can't be using it and the other not or else it doesn't work. Okay, next we're going to do our Grand Bach Ma. We're gonna do one Grand Bach Ma and one Tondu. So we're gonna go up one, close two, Tondu three, close four. Side, close six, Tondu seven, close eight. Back, 90 or above, close, tondu and close, 90 or above, tondu and close. And this, we're just gonna stay on fosse for this one. So we're not using our apalm, we're just staying on fosse with our arm in second. Um, I want you to really think of underneath to lift your legs so you feel your turnout. So like the underdog on a swing, when someone gives you an underdog, you're thinking of that to help lift your leg up so your leg goes underneath to lift and close. So in your grand pot ma, you should go lift, tendu, close every single time. And then our tendu and close. Um, so because there's two, it's even. As you go to the side, you will go grand pot ma, closing where you came from. So closing front, then tendu, closing back. Yes, here we go. Up one, close two, tendu three, close four. And we're going to repeat it twice, actually. So you're going to go on top and then do it all one more time. exercises to try and think of something that you really want to work on. So maybe it's your turnout or stretching your feet or straightening your knees um, or you're keeping your arms, your elbows lifted and coming from your back. And then maybe you could have your mom or someone at your house watch you and see if they, they can see that you're really working on those things. Um, another thing you can do is um, you can video yourself and then watch it and see if you notice that you were doing the, the things you were working on. Or maybe you could see what you were doing great and maybe what needs some work. Um, you can also post some, or have your mom post on their Instagram um, a video, a little video of you doing some of this and tagging Wasatch Dance and telling us something you're working on. Um, if you have any questions, you can have, you can have your mom text me or, or Miss Amy with a question you have about the bar. Um, and in the description, I'll post the album of the, of the music so you can use that or just use the video. Um, thank you for dancing with me through this video. We miss you guys so much and hope that you're, you're having fun dancing at home. See ya.